My name is Dr. Charles Young. I'm Editor of Clinical Evidence and Editor-in-Chief of Best Practice. I'm also a practicing emergency physician. For the next three or four minutes, I would like to give you a tour of the key features of the BMJ Group's latest and most exciting product, Best Practice. Best Practice is a decision support tool for healthcare professionals to use at the point of care. And we have designed both the website and the content to provide answers to key clinical questions quickly and intuitively. The first area of the website I'd like to illustrate to you are the search and browse functions. On the left hand side of the screen we have arranged all the content in key clinical categories. On the right hand side of the screen the content is also listed alphabetically as you'd expect. In addition and importantly at the top of the screen is a free text search box. If I type in a simple search, chronic cough, and hit the search icon, that will take us to all the content related to the symptoms of chronic cough. In general terms, BMJ best practice content is divided into two groups of articles. Assessment articles provide detailed guidance on the diagnosis of key clinical symptoms and signs, and in doing so, the use of important diagnostic tests and procedures. Our condition articles provide detailed guidance on the complete management of a very extensive range of medical conditions. Clicking on the link to the assessment article of chronic cuff takes us to that area of the website. As you can see on the landing page is a summary and a list of differential diagnoses which can be sorted either by category or by frequency. These type of articles also provide important information about urgent considerations for patients with this symptom and detailed information about exactly how to make the diagnosis. The differential diagnoses listings again can be filtered by category or frequency and contain key features of how to make a diagnosis or how to exclude a diagnosis given certain history, examination and test findings. Using asthma as an example now, if I click the link that takes us away from the assessment monograph of asthma and through to the condition monograph of asthma in adults. As I mentioned before, the condition monographs contain detailed information about the complete management of a patient with this disease, including background information, information about prevention and information about follow-up. <coughs> Importantly, a lot of time and effort has been dedicated to providing clear and concise information about how to make a diagnosis in a patient with suspected asthma and also how to treat this condition. Looking at the treatment section in detail, we provide information about each of the subgroups of patients with asthma. And within these subgroups, the information is broken down into easy to use directive clinical information. Clicking on one of the drug links, takes us away from the best practice content and through to a drug formulae, in this case through to the BNF. Moving back to the best practice content, another important section of the condition monographs is the evidence section where we contain the latest appraised systematic reviews produced by clinical evidence which relate to the treatment of asthma. And following these links take us to very detailed information about the evidence supporting various categorical statements in the treatment of this disease. Other areas of the website of note include patient leaflets which provide clinical evidence information but written in a language that's suitable for patients to understand. In addition the website is personalizable in the My Best Practice section. To illustrate this, I'll type in the search term again, hit the search icon, and this time if I click the Save This Search tab, and then go back to the My Best Practice section of the website, you'll be able to see that my search term has been saved. And I can also bookmark key articles, which I know I'm going to use frequently. In conclusion then, BMJ Best Practice is a key decision support tool providing crucial clinical information when and where it is needed most. For further information, please contact either myself or our sales support team. Thank you.